Hello, Internet. It is John Bundy, and I am back with a classic Master System challenge. I'm a bit late on this one, not doing the challenge because it was a year ago, but for what it is uh, representative of. And that is. Wimbledon! Now, because this game is going for a while, um, I have not asked for a guest commentator, Bill Weathers, to uh, partake. Because I will probably need to actually concentrate on this, so... Um, again, I uh, haven't played this game before. Uh, well, I've done a trial run, but before this, I've never actually played it before. Um, I've never really been to Tez games that much. I mean, besides Wii Sports Tennis. And I also actually played, uh, I think on the Game Boy Color, Mario Tennis. But that's pretty much it. And I think with the Game Boy Color Mario Tennis, that was more of an adventure game that was what I liked about it, rather than just being a straight tennis game. But anyway, let's begin, because I do have to actually pick my kids up from the nursery at some point. Um, I'll be picking the same settings that Ollie, 8-Bit Boy UK, who sets all these challenges, um, pick what he picked. Which is... We went for Mauser. And we're going up against. Cortez. And you see the difference in their skills, yet we still get absolutely hammered. So, yeah. Also, I don't know why, but you see here the border. Like, it's not my TV, because you've still got the green around it, but like, there's more leaves. Anyway. Just sorry, I just noticed. So, anyway. Oh shit, that was the bad button. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Apparently his backswing isn't that great. I'm not really into tennis that much. I mean, I'm not really into sports, so... So like I never really understood why it goes 15, 30, 40. Like just seems a bit weird to me, but Oh <laughs> I don't know about the aspect change that just grooves me up for this. I don't really expect to actually do well in this game. I mean, the challenge is there's no actual score. It's just to get win a set and see how far I can get through. I don't think I'll win a set, but yeah, it's about trying it out rather than doing well. When I do these challenges, I am not trying to get like first place. Oh, fuck's sake. It's just an excuse to actually play these games. Now, if I do well, don't get me wrong, I like that. Thank you. 
It's a pity we're going to have someone like Mario who would actually be the umpire. Is that what it's called in tennis? sports fans is watching someone play virtual tennis actually entertaining I guess I could argue that how is it different than watching real life people play tennis you're not the one who's actually partaking Sneaky little bugger, trying to do a fast shot. Yay, I got one. I actually have no idea what this will go to. I mean, we must not be very popular because there's no one in the stands to watch. Damn it. Too quick. That's what she said. See, look, it's empty. I keep it authentic today. I'm actually using the uh, Master System pad rather than my arcade stick. Apparently, I don't do too well if I'm on the back. I mean, the graphics, you know, are serviceable. The game itself, as far as I can tell, is well made. But I, as I don't really play Tez games, I can't really say otherwise. Um, Ollie did say that out of all the Tez games he tried on the Master System, this was, in his opinion, the best, so... And, I mean... For what I know about tennis, yeah, it seems to do the job quite well. Um, the graphics, you know, I think are, I mean, don't get me wrong, they're not the best thing I've ever seen on the Master System, but I think they're pretty decent. Um, what's that game? Time. 
um, I mention the music as well, and yeah, I mean, it hasn't got great, has gone grating for me, so I think they did pretty well. I mean, it'd be, I guess it'd be nice if there was some variety. Maybe there is if you pick different, like, um, uh, pitches, uh, courts. Like, you, know, you could pick tarmac or lawn or whatever. First juice. Oh. I did see that there's a uh, Wimbledon 2, so that wasn't picked for uh, this year's Wimbledon. Maybe we'll see it for next year's. But again, if there's no actual score, then I don't know, is it like how many, how well you can win, maybe? <clears throat> like if you win it. Okay. I lost, but to be fair, that was always going to happen. So, yep. Um, yeah, I mean, for something just to play, it's decent enough. I don't think I'd pay a lot of money for this game. I don't, I don't know how much it goes for, but maybe if I was playing against someone else, that might be quite fun, but as a one player versus the computer, eh, it fills a slot of time. So, yeah, I mean, I haven't tried it, give it a go. But it's not something that I can see myself going back to unless there's someone I want to do two player. So, anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed that, and I will catch you all next time.